um, what's up guys? So, it's a bit of a weird <laughs> moment, um, I've kind of backtracked a little bit, as you can see I'm playing some Nordica. Um, yeah, I was doing a bit of, f like, farming and getting some stuff, and I've come back up here just quickly, just to kind of show you that, um, Passing 200 I was down here, Oxygen efficiency you know, greatly decreased. looking for diamonds, as I do, checking all these nooks and crevices, trying to find any form of diamond. Maybe this will be the diamond I need. Nope. And, um, there I was swimming, and, um, found this! And I literally, <laughs> I, like, obviously I found it, and then I came back to, like, start recording, because I literally walked in and went, I think I should start recording. Um, yep. Um, I have no idea what this is. I'll be honest. I would like to say that I am not scared at all of what's in here. There is a floating fish. It's pretty cool. I'm going to grab him. <laughs> it's just hanging out. Don't worry, bro. I'll free you. I'll free you from this prison. But yeah, um, so yeah, I thought I'd quickly start filming it. I don't know uh, how long this will be. I'm sure it's nothing. Like, I mean, I'm sure that everyone who's watching this knows exactly what this is. But, um, it doesn't seem to be anything in here. And yeah, it kind of, uh, yeah, there's nothing really in here, actually. Well, this is boring. This is sad. There's not even like an ore or anything. Any ores down here? Maybe this is something later on in life. Maybe. I like that when I sprint, I put my thing away. Hmm, interesting. This is very cool. But now I really wish I knew what it was. <laughs> um. I guess. That's it for the time being. Calorie intake recommended. Um, ooh, another cave fish. Huh? Huh? <laughs> I eat these cave fish. Um, nom 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 Yeah, that's really all I've got. Um, <laughs> um, no doubt I'll probably chop, chop this, chuck this bit on to the beginning of the next episode. Which I'm going to be filming tomorrow. It's currently uh, 11.30 at night. And I'm just out exploring. But um, yeah. I'll see you guys then. So let's cut to future Ben. Oh. <gasps> I just got diamonds. <laughs> oh shit. My torch is dead. I don't think I have any. Yeah I don't have any batteries. Welcome aboard, Captain. We go back to base. I just found diamonds. And I'm gonna... You know what? Maybe I'll just film a part now. Because <laughs> I've already found a bunch of stuff. Oh, and a box. There's a box there. Maybe that's related to the cry um crashed um thing I found. Yeah, alright. I'm going to go back to base and possibly make the cutter. Finally, after all this time. So yeah, I'll probably cut back to base when I get there. Maybe, unless something exciting happens along the way back. Hmm. So they must be like the um jellyfish caves I've been hearing about. I did a bit of look out. I like I looked up a map. Because I really didn't know what was going on or anything about any of the biomes. And then my friend told me that, like, the map is technically the same. Like, areas of the map are the same. It's just they're in different spots. Like, the map, the areas in the map are randomly generated. But the maps are technically, oh shit, they are technically all just the same. So I looked up a map to kind of, um... 
a vending machine down there. Finding so much rubble. Excuse me, may I have a snack, please? What is this random mark on the map? Is that the life pod? I must be going at an upward angle. It's weird. I've never seen it from like this certain angle. It looked like a mouth for a second. I mean, the icon on the escape pod already looks um, like a face. But that just made it look even more. Alrighty. Um. Do I need again? Oh, baby, I'm gonna make this cutter. I'm gonna be awesome. I'm gonna cut so many things open. Um, but I, I guess I should also, um, say, uh, what, what is up, everybody, and welcome to Subnautica. Actually, I might take my jump rope on the back. I'm a bit, a bit toasty. Actually, why don't I jump it? Because I went to the movies, I just saw The Eternals. It was pretty, pretty good. I enjoyed it. I thought it was pretty fun. I'm not gonna, I'm gonna spoil anything, but, uh, yeah. I enjoyed it. So, it was a friend. I would recommend people to watch it like if you're into Marvel movies I'm a huge Marvel movie fan I know that probably makes me a peasant or something but um I really enjoy the Marvel movies I love the comics so I love the movies it makes sense really in my eyes that's enough for me but yeah what's up guys and welcome to the video um sorry about the weird beginning where I discovered a weird room Passing and that's what began the video but um yeah I just discovered a weird room and was like I need to find out what this is so glad that it's like takes such a long amount of effort <laughs> It took like almost 20% of its battery just to open this door. Oh, and there's another one, of course. If you wanted to give me like, um, oh, I can get into this room? So that was useless, technically, cutting into this. Well, I mean, I still need to get into this room, but that room was useless. 30 seconds. If I stop, is it like, no, it continues to the same spot, cool. Alright, I'm gonna quickly... Jump in my car. But yeah, I was literally just out, you know, exploring for things, finding resources, when I happened to come across that weird, um, alien looking cave battery fragment. I've already got that. I've got that too. Notification station fragment. That could be useful. Also, got this weird egg. I don't know what it's for. I think it's attacking me. Could um, you stop, please? Can I make a modification station? That rhymes. Oh wait, I don't have the ingredients for it. I thought I did, no. I need two more. There was one in there, so I should probably go back. High capacity, it was like high capacity tank. Lightweight high capacity tank, modification. Light to build allows for enhanced maneuver, enhanced maneuver, Never mind. Thank you. Oh, fuck. I tried to say it and I couldn't, so I yeah, I gave up. I quit <laughs> while I was ahead. Someone said. I mean, I'm glad that I got that because it means that I can cut shit open. <laughs> but I'm also just like I still don't know what I'm doing or what I need to do. Like, you know, it really didn't change that much. Can I sneak into this cave? This thing. I can just. Can I go any deeper? Is there even anywhere deeper to go? No, there's some quartz. Yeah, okay, yeah, this was nothing really down here. I don't know why I tried. Emergency. Starvation imminent. Seek calorie intake immediately. Yeah, okay, yep. I got Ow. I gotta go eat some food. Um, fish, if you guys could just, um, fucking stop attacking the ship for a little bit. That would be really nice. This is Sunbeam. This is you know Aurora. We're from a little transgub on the far side of Andromeda. And we have a saying there. 
There's no bad without the good, no good without the bad. Sounds like you tasted a bunch of the former, but that only means you're overdue a whole lot of the latter. Might just be we're it. We're scanning for somewhere to park. We'll be in touch when we find it. Sunbeam out. <gasps> Pretty sure I r remember that, um... That they don't make it. I know it's a bit of a squeal, but I was... Well, I mean, it's not really that big of a squeal, but yeah. They, um... They don't make it. Like, they get close. And then they get shot down by something. I think it's the same thing that shot us down. Vital signs stabilizing. Oh, shit. Did it again. Um, but yeah. So I'm gonna just probably keep exploring, looking for beacon parts. So. Yeah. If I'm not really here talking, or if I cut a lot, it's because that's why. Because I'm just kind of looking for shit. Looking for parts that I need. Can I open this door? I can. Survival always been here, or, and I just never found it. Integrating new PDA data. Um, repairing, repairing, repairing. I like that my repairing is slowly picking the wires up and then putting a panel back on it. This game looks cool. There's an actual cave cave that I can swim in. This is exciting. And by swimming, I mean like it's deep enough for me to actually fit the seam off in here. Oh, and there's a big hole open here. I need to get out of as uh, if I need to. It's pretty cool. There's nothing here though. I've also been thinking about actually going to the Aurora, but, um, I don't know, I don't know if there'll be anything there for me at this point in the game. I kind of want to know where I am exactly. Because so I know to the east is, like, the Aurora, so, uh, oh wait, actually, I think I'm really close to the Aurora. Oh, okay, I know I am, I'm, like, behind it. That looks like something big. And I'll be honest. I'm gonna. I'll be honest. When it's <laughs> all the bubble, like the bubble water, when I swim around, when it's night time, and I just out, I see a big tail swimming around. I, I shit my pants. I, 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 sh I shit so hard in my pantaloons just then when I saw that big tail. I don't know if you'll be able to see it, or maybe it was just me, but it looked like there was a ginormous tail that, like, poked out of the... All I... Life form readings in this region are sparse. The Aurora's radioactive fallout will have devastating effects on the alien system. Oh, shit. Shit. shit out of me. Is there anything I can do? Or not really. Let's get the fuck out of here. Nah. Goodbye. Bye. Goodbye. Let's go. Let's leave. I'm on like two... My my vehicle's on like two health. So I don't think I'm going to make it. Oh god. No joke. I literally had a heart attack. My heart is racing. Oh my god. Oh my god, my vehicle's dead now. I'm gonna have to get a new one now. It's gonna take me so much effort to get. You still following me, you grumpy boy? Oh, oh my heart. Vital signs stabilizing. First aid kit. It's 
kind of helpful, I guess. Shit. <laughs> My car's broken. Damn it. <laughs> Well, that's really annoying. I already know how to make this seamoth. So I don't need these. I'm just... I really need the beacon. Because then I can mark shit. It's also, it was night. I really shouldn't have been out in, like, such a deadly spot at night. I couldn't see shit. Uploaded to PDA. Awesome. Pretty much what they're saying is sh shit be far. Um, this is the other one that I just found. Hyper 12 sunk to the ocean bed. Alright, well, I need to make another Seamoth first before I do anything. Ah, oh, shit. You want to pick it up? I just don't remember what I need for it, that's all. What I need to look at. Does any mean get power cell, two glass, lubricant, and lead? I think I have majority of that. Welcome aboard, Captain. Now it's full throttle. Well, actually, I should get some fish first because I am like starving. All right. If I can find a couple of the pink fishies, fishy pink fishies. That would be really useful. Before I leave. Just so that I can make water. Alright, let's go on an adventure. Wait, is this near where that like guys of it is? That I was saw before. I like that the stalkers like play with metal. It's kind of fun. Which if I jump up here and have a look at like land, I think to be uh, directly horizontal to the aurora. I'm actually, almost ahead of it, I'm, like parallel to it, perfectly. Almost. Still really fucking scary. I'll be honest, especially with the water being like pitch black. Oh, the bolt. This is the. I haven't been here before. I've heard of this place, but the bold zone. Warning. Oh, Maximum shit, 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 sorry, sorry, car, it's really hard to tell exactly where, like, oh, this meters. lava hole Oxygen there, efficiency not terrifying in any way, shape, or form, Exercise caution when diving deeper. oh, don't worry, I will, don't worry, I'm fucking terrified enough already. Oh, there's an electric one over there. Warning. Maximum depth reached. Shit, sorry. Damage imminent. Yep, it's hard to tell. This thing's almost destroyed already. Oh, sorry, I missed the fish. Oh, I need oxygen. Shit, 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 shit. Get out. Should be fine. I should be fine. I'm like super close compared to the last time. Drowning. See, we're fine. I just streamed this game. Everything is terrifying in this game. I hate that everything is so fucking terrifying. No, it isn't. Jesus. Okay, that thing, like, mesmerizes you or something? And I hate it. <laughs> I hate it with a passion. That was scary. Alright, we're going in again. We're actually going in this time. Modification station fragment. Something I actually need. Some electric water. Cyclops sonar engines. That sounds useful, actually. High capacity. The lightweight tank thing. It says it's at the modification. Cook and sterilize small organisms for immediate consumption. See, this is all the modification station. Love saying that. It's so much fun. 
material modules. I don't think I'd be able to make that. I think I need to um have the Cyclops. As most things I feel like are like Cyclops based. I feel like a lot of the modification stuff is based on having the Cyclops. Which I don't have yet. So I've got a Cyclops Sonar engine, but I haven't seen that yet either. Right, I'm gonna do something that's probably s a little bit risky. I'm going to go to the Aurora. What was that? What was all this shaking? Why is the ship shaking so much? What's going on? Is the ship going to explode or something? What are these things? I don't know if they're friends or not. And I'm kind of scared to get near them. To be honest, I'm kind of scared to get near anything anymore. It's kind of weird being on land, I'll be honest. Back here, you stupid crab. I feel like I should, like, look at the thing, data pad, to see if they're friends or not. Oh, nope, they're not. God, I'm scared. I don't like these. No, fuck off. Maybe this was a mistake <laughs> to come here. Everything, why does everything want to kill me? Can't we just be friends, guys? Please. What is up, everybody? I'm going to have to end this episode here. But if you guys enjoyed, please leave a like, comment your thoughts down below, and be sure to subscribe so that you never miss a video. And I'll see you all in the next one.